Hey you all, let's take a moment to remember what the goal is in brain retraining. Hey, I'm Melissa with The Simple Life Wife. I make videos about brain retraining. If you're into that, please subscribe. I would love to have you. Uh, just a quick video here to remember what our goal is in brain retraining. The goal is resiliency. And in the program I did, Limbic System Rewired, they said this a lot, and I was reminded of it today. And it's such a great way to think about it. Um, because it reminds you it's not about your circumstances or any of the input that, whether it's food or triggering people or triggering situations or lifestyle or anything like that. Um, the goal is not to get away from all that. I'm not saying that. Anyway, so the goal is not to get away from the triggers, but to lower your response to the triggers. So I think it's good to remember that um, because we, I, I did this recently. We, I had stressful life situations going on, just very normal things, but they were extremely stressful for me. And um, I found myself giving in and I, I felt like such a failure recently and I feel like God forgives and God continues to teach. So we are all going to fail a million and one times through this brain retraining journey. I had a good cry about it and um, telling God my, just how I felt like a failure through when the circumstances were stressful and hard, I gave in to it. But today's a new day, isn't it? And his mercies are new and he's showing me how to walk. That's what this is. We are learning how to walk properly. So I'm very thankful and I can feel for people. I, it's one of the things of going through hard times is, and stumbling is it gives you, you can feel for people that are in those situations and Lord willing, <laughs> handle them better next time. But anyway, I just wanted to remind you all, resiliency is what we are after here. Not to get out of the triggering situations, but to not to learn to not be triggered as easily. So um, just a little example, uh, with little kids, I have little kids, and which tends to trigger me to be overwhelmed. It's just a thing in my life uh, that I'm brain retraining with. And so just doing incremental training around that and to not be so fatigued just because I have little kids, you know, and retraining around how that can actually be energizing. It's such a blessing, all those things. I don't have to get out of the little kid season of life in order to function like God wants me to function and um, to be resilient and to be a good mood mommy, you know, all that stuff. <laughs> So it, it's more than that, of course, more than just kids. It's, it, you know, we can be triggered by so many things. Like it can be so many different things that trigger us. I, I was just reminded today, even if you're living in a very triggering environment, whatever it is that's triggering your issues, you don't have to get out of it in order to brain retrain well. Um, you just keep going with the program and um, keep bringing it to God and do all the steps that you're supposed I mean, I, I'm not going to go through the whole brain retraining exercises here, but um, I just want to remind you that you're learning to be resilient in the circumstances, not just getting through the circumstances. That's what I was allowing myself to do recently was just, I just have to get through it and then I'll get back to the right mindset. You know, that is not the proper way to think about it. You don't want to just get through it. Like your brain is very plastic, which means it's very moldable uh, and better able to be rewired in the harder times even. Keep reminding yourself of that and you don't need to... I mean, you know, sometimes people do need to go have a break or something from a certain... And I'm not trying to condemn you. It, it is sometimes what you need. And if it's what you need, then do it. 
but I'm, I'm telling you, you don't have to. Like, it is very much part of brain retraining to live in a triggering environment, to be in a triggering environment and still brain retrain through it and learn to, um, learn to respond differently. I just wanted to encourage you in that. And also, I make these videos for myself just so I remember the things I'm learning and, you know, that's being brought back to my mind. Okay, I will see you next time. Bye.